So what's one of my crank today is the Green Lantern movie, and here's what my problem is, is that it's not that I'm comparing Green Lantern to the Dark Knight or anything else, I'm comparing Green Lantern to Green Lantern. What I'm talking about is Green Lantern First Flight, the animated movie that came out back in around 2009, 2010, was perfect. It started off in the first five minutes where Hal Jordan meets Aban Sul, he gets the ring, turns to the Green Lantern, and then he just starts kicking butt. And the movie was great, very fast paced. Now I do realize that the movie couldn't go in that direction because you want to build up the character and all these things. But here's the truth of the matter is, like always, my problem brings us the question of the day. Do you think there's going to be a second Green Lantern movie? A lot of critics snubbed it. A lot of comic book fans snubbed it. Matter of fact, all during the weekend, the only thing I saw on Twitter was Green Lantern sucks. On top of that, the movie was only brave able to bring in one-fourth of what it costs to make in its opening weekend. And normally, with international box office sales hinging on how well it does here in America, there's a chance where the movie won't break even, which isn't good. The fact that the movie had to be re-rendered almost three times just only added to the problem. The movie cost $200 million to make, even though other movies such as Thor and X-Men only cost $120 and $150 million. So because of which, with Green Lantern only bringing in $56 million, they have a lot more ground to cover, which means DC might be saying goodbye to the Green Lantern. So if you have any opinion on this, if you like the movie, didn't like the movie, you know, check out the uh, little thing below that's called the comment area. Leave a comment. If you're on our Facebook page, leave a comment on there. If you're on MyMorningJoe.com, you're going to have to log in before you can do that. And if you're on Twitter, retweet this message. And like always, my name's Frank Martin, and that's what winds my crank.